wondering why it shows as Microsoft Basic Display Adapter rather than the current GPU installed on your PC. This video may help. Here are the things that you must do to fix this issue. Before making any big changes or updates to your Windows 10 PC, laptop, bear in mind that the first thing you should always do is create a backup in case something goes wrong in the future operation. Now, this restore point is your sole chance to return to a decent configuration before severe problems arise. If you've never done anything like this before, here's how. On the desktop, click the search box, type create restore point, then hit enter or click create restore point. A system properties dialog box will appear. Click system protection. Make sure that protection is enabled to all your drives, especially drive C, if it's off. Then you have to click the drive to turn it on. Note, if you want to change the capacity of restore point, you can click configure and change it to your desired capacity. Click create. Name your restore point. It is best that you name it the date you created the restore point. Click create. Wait until the process is done. It will be done in moments. Corrupted display driver is one component that might cause this issue. You will need to reinstall the graphic drivers to see if this is the problem. On the desktop, click start button on the taskbar. Click device manager. Click display adapters to expand. Right click Microsoft basic display adapter. Click update software driver. most circumstances, having a graphics issue will result in the error notice you may encounter with the display. However, it may not show in other cases due to inadequate rendering graphics. The driver may need to be updated via Windows Update or downloaded from the manufacturer. From the desktop, click Start button on the taskbar. Click on Settings. Click on Update and Security. Then let the system finish all the available updates. After the update, don't forget to restart your PC, laptop, then see if the issue is resolved. If you know the brand and model of your graphics adapter, you may go directly to the manufacturer's website and seek for the most recent update for it. This may be the simplest solution because it is simple to locate and install after downloading. In some circumstances, Windows 10 users are unable to update their graphics adapter driver because it is missing from device manager particularly AMD Radeon graphics. It is now a huge issue, particularly for people who are not technically competent and wind up replacing their graphics card because they believe it is faulty. <music> Having a new graphics card is fantastic, but before you go and switch on your PC, ensure that all peripherals, particularly your AMD Radeon graphics card, are securely attached. This is the first and most critical action you should do. So, begin disassembling your PC and double checking everything inside the system unit. Other devices may be concealed in the device manager at times. Therefore, display all devices to ensure that your graphics adapter is not buried. The default option usually hides other devices, which might be the source of the problem. On the desktop, right-click Start button on the taskbar. Click Device Manager. Click View. Click Show Hidden Devices. Click Display Adapters to expand. See if the AMD Radeon adapter is there. If so, then right-click AMD Radeon adapter. Click Uninstall. Restart your PC to let the system reinstall the driver. Once you're back to the desktop, see if the graphics is now showing in the Device Manager, but make sure that you uncheck the Show Hidden Devices option. That's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it if you can leave a like, subscribe to our channel, or share this video to your friends. This can greatly help in making sure that Google's algorithm can find and recommend this video to others.